We keep bumping at each other in uh, here in Norway, man. You just can't, yeah. they can't keep you away. No, they can't. It's but, but of course, this time a uh, different team, but same team in a lot of ways. Yeah. No. Uh, yeah, a different team, but familiar for me. It's for familiar team. Um, yeah, but I'm happy to be back here in Norway. You know, obviously, uh, it's been a big step up for Rally this season. Uh, of course, dating back to the beginning of the year, going to the UAE and and uh, step up in competition, racing, and classification. Um, it's gone pretty well. Yeah, no, I think uh, this year we've made like a lot of big gains um, as a team. Um, you know, I think it, it's still lots of new stuff in, with the European stuff, but we've been doing uh, a really good job, like with you know the support of, that we have of Rally. Um, you know, it's making everything kind of go smooth having such a you know long-term partner mm -hmm. and uh, yeah the team's uh, motivated to continue to grow and I think we're doing a lot of the right things. How does it really feel though being back because obviously with direct energy uh, French team uh, obviously uh, there's language there's uh, different races in, in the program Do you, is it is it good to be back home so to speak? Yeah for me it's good um, you know I, I enjoyed a lot of the things I did at direct energy and but for me this is a off the bike it makes life uh, easier for me so um, yeah I'm happy to be here and I'm, I'm excited to be a part of this team trying to grow in Europe and uh, you know kind of share the experience that I did pick up at Direct Energy or with Spider Tech like I've done the spectrum now I've come over to Europe for really small teams I've been on a really big team in Europe so it's kind of like uh, a little bit of everything that I've seen and what's the main thing that you feel like you're bringing to this squad from the things that you've learned and, and what are some things that you see also rally you know doing right yeah, I think one of the main things is just some of the experience in the races and, and you know, I've been able to see a lot of stuff and I was very fortunate at Direct Energy to do all the classics, do a grand tour. So just, you know, like those um, those experiences, the things that just in the races that, like especially in the spring, the spring trip we did, like, you know, we had a lot of hard race days and, uh, but that really, that's just, those are normal. But for, you know, when you come over from North America for your first time or whatever, it's not, it feels you know like a really a really big jump into the deep end but you know i think it's just kind of figuring out that that is going to become our normal and um yeah and then you know i think that um the team's been doing a good job of providing a really good amount of support over here for the riders and uh, everything is pointing towards that growing and the infrastructure of the team growing so everything runs more smoothly. You know, uh, you know obviously uh, you've got Montreal, Quebec coming up. The 2018 season's pretty much wrapping up uh, for you guys. Where do you see your future in 2019 and your role evolving with the team? Yeah, I think for me, my role, I, you know, I hope to um, be able to just keep being reliable for the team, being able to be there and um, you know support some of the young guys that have different ambitions, and then I still have uh, personal ambitions that I want to you know chase, and I think that this team allows me to do that as well. So um, just kind of continue to grow with the team and and see what kind of races we get next year. Thank you. Thank you.